All right, got uh, Leroy Popowski. We're at Summit of Pikes Peak. Uh, we're inside because it's freezing outside. And uh, Leroy, how many uh, wins is this for you up here in this race? Um, this is this is four. Uh, yeah. Three on the newer course, and then one when we initially started down in Manitou Springs. Have you won every year? Well, every year that I've raced it. I think there was a year or two in between that I did race yeah, it. Yeah, I think one gone. year, yeah. So, because uh, so, the race is not that old, so no. four out of five. And you just uh, endured some brutal um, wins. Can you tell us about it? Yeah, the weather was tough today. I'll tell you, props to everybody who finished, even though a lot of people pushing bikes uh, that I saw in the Citizens Race. Very cold, uh, yeah. windy, and uh, this is by far the coldest weather I think we've endured uh, racing up here. Yeah, and you hammered it. Did you catch your time? Oh, the time is slow. I think it's about 114, which I've done this on 108, but winds were strong. It broke apart really early. And yeah. It was more yeah. every competitor versus the weather versus yeah. other competitors, necessarily. <laughs> so. Exactly. So, uh, you know, I mean, it's t how do you ride in that wind? I mean, you just got to tough it out, or what's yeah. the deal? Yeah, keep your cadence and uh, try to stay warm. So I had full fingered gloves and arm warmers, and I was still cold. My hands were numb by the time I arrived at the top so yeah cold try to stay warm <laughs> I mean you're moving pretty fast at 14,000 feet you got something extra going for you you just uh, got the genetics for this climbing thing or what's the deal Oh, I don't know. I'm a wimp when it comes to the cold, actually. Despite the fact I did my undergrad in Minnesota and ran several cold winters in Minnesota, I think I'm yeah. getting, uh, weaker in that regard. So yeah. it takes a little more clothing. Yeah. So did you do uh, like Mount Evans this year? Or? I did. Uh, yeah. I didn't have a great race there. I yeah. actually the weekend before that I had a big ride there. I uh, typically ride up towards Woodland Park and we sometimes get road closures and I was yeah. planning to do a long ride Yeah. but I was at 122 miles arriving in Woodland Park and then they said there's uh, a road closure that's going to be three to four hours so I went yeah. back to Deckers and then back to Cast Rock and ended up with about 182 miles that yeah. day and then I did 127 the day after that yeah. so yeah. kind of killed myself before I went. Yeah. I don't know what the how fast the wind is going out there but I've got to guess it's a 50 up here at the top for sure. No idea. It was, it was blowing though. Yeah. So you certainly try to ride the center line and not get blown too far to either side. Right. Yeah, gotcha. It looks like some people were almost getting blown off the road. and. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people are walking, I think, just because they're getting blown. Walking so and, I mean, having a hard time standing up. Mm -hmm. um, so, anyway. Well, listen, that's uh, four out of five years. You, you win the thing. Congratulations. Thank you so much. That's a, that's a great deal. No, thanks. All right, man.